Hi, this is Steve Knight and welcome to Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update. Starting with the Euro and the pair swung in both directions with a 90 pip range, but ultimately ended the day fractionally lower at 1 spot 1398. Much of the volatility was based around a speech from Janet Yellen, which appeared to be slightly dovish with the Fed Chair being less than persuasive on forward-looking growth. However, the dovishness was overshadowed by a surprise uptick in the US PPI to spot 1% month on month. Moving forward, the pair is likely to look towards the US CPI and consumer data due out in the coming session. In contrast, the cable was a strong performer as the pair found some support during the Asian session to close up around 50 pips at one spot 29.39. However, the cable's rally was largely contained as Europe came online and price action ran into sellers around the one spot 29.55 mark. Regardless, price action still retains its position above the 50 and 100 day moving averages. Moving forward, the market is likely to look towards the US retail sales and CPI results due out shortly. Finally, turning to the Aussie dollar now, and the pair rose strongly during the trading day, following an uptick in Australian consumer inflation expectations to 4.4%. Additionally, the pair also received some support with the presently dovish information coming out of the Fed. Subsequently, the Aussie finished the day around 50 pips higher at spot 77.30. However, do note that the daily RSI oscillator is now in oversold territory. Moving forward, keep a watch on the US CPI and retail sales figures due out shortly. Well, that's all I've got for you today. This is Steve Knight with Blackwell Global. Thanks for watching.